Hey, how you doing guys? Austin here. Hey, I've got an interesting idea for you. Okay, so uh, <clears throat> as you can tell, I'm not at my normal studio. I'm in Las Vegas right now and I'm in my room. And uh, you can see that's the view right there behind me. That's pretty cool. Um, and I'm having some problems with my, my new, my, I've got a new laptop and I can't record my screen yet. I'm still trying to figure out how to do that. So that's so why you're going to have some talking head videos like me just doing kind of these uh, fireside chats. But here's what I want to talk to you about. Shiba Inu compared to Tesla. This was a real interesting article that I saw this morning and I read it. And the whole gist of it was this, is that, is that, Shiba Inu was compared to Tesla in the capacity of be of, of a of a rival started up against Tesla. So there are, if you don't know this, there's a couple of car companies that have been started that are going directly at Tesla, the kind of ultra uh, luxury car market. Okay, and there's a lot of articles out there about these rival startups to Tesla. And I thought this was cool. And there was an article on the news service that I used this morning that was talking about how Shiba Inu is, they're, they're, they're positioning Shiba Inu as a, as, in this scenario, as the competitor to say more established coins like Dogecoin or things like that. And I thought that was a real interesting topic of conversation because number one, the fact that there's content out there and they're, they're using Shiba Inu in the same you know, capacity and breadth as Tesla is pretty cool. I mean, that's why I, I did the, you know, the thumbnail compared to Tesla because it kind of was, and it was, and I, I always love these kind of philosophical um, discussions that you can have because part of the job I have for you guys bringing you content here, guys, is not always to bring you price analysis and prediction and the latest and greatest. It's also to come sometimes kind of go, isn't that cool and isn't that interesting? Let's think about that for a minute because what it really goes to is it goes to how the mindset and the uh, mentality and the attitude towards Shiba Inu is shifting. Think about that. Three months ago, would somebody have written a piece of content comparing Shiba Inu to Tesla and talking about it, you know, being an upstart, you know, about Shiba Inu being being a competitive upstart to say Dogecoin? Yes, I know Shiba Inu was originally, you know, categorized as the Dogecoin killer, which I didn't like that when it first came out. It was, but it turns out it was pretty much a a good stroke of marketing genius on the executive and the dev team when they came up with that little bit of marketing, you know, piece of marketing content that it definitely helped them get out of the gate and get more, you know, um, more attention on them. But Shiba Inu being compared to the Goliaths out there, you know, the, the these uh, these bigger tokens and, and being a competitor to them, it's funny. I don't really think of it that way. I don't think of Shiba Inu being a competitor to anybody. I don't think of Cardano being, a, well, Cardano's competitor to Ethereum, but you get my point. I mean, I don't think of Shiba Inu that way. And that's what's interesting about that. Do you think, let me drop in the comments, do you think that Shiba Inu is a competitor to Dogecoin or to Saitama or to, you know, whatever it may be? Do you? I don't. I don't look at it that way. I view them as, as assets that I own and I own them for different reasons. And I and I own them because I like the utility and the project and the down and the ecosystem and, and where they're taking it and all those things. But I don't view them as competitors. That's just not how I view them. And but I know some of you guys do. And that's really interesting. It's a really interesting dialogue. And it, it kind of goes to some of these videos I've done where it's like, why are we emotionally attached to our tokens? And we just are, and that's cool, and that's that's interesting. I always like to kind of look at the psychology around some of this stuff because I think it's cool and it and it also says a lot about us and the tokens we own and and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, Shiba Inu compared to Tesla. There you go. Isn't that isn't that an interesting uh, isn't that an interesting situation? All right, guys. With all that said, um, I'm trying to figure out some tech issues with my computer and recording screens and all that. If I can't get that figured out, you're just gonna have a lot of me talking at you uh, like this. All right, guys. With all that said, take it easy. Bye.